Hi Scorpio, welcome to this Tower Love Reading. My name's Sophia. Please support the people in this community who I've put up on this channel. Check out about Julian Hassan. Uh, join me in UK if you want to join the human uh, chain. Um, okay, let's jump in. Uh, so let's jump in. Let's see what's going on with you, your connection. I'll get some advice, all that kind of good stuff. Let's see what's happening. So Knight of Wands, Judgment, Ace of Swords. So the Knight of Wands seems to me like uh, it's fading away. What I mean by that is this casual, this, this uh, temporary, this in and out behavior is going away maybe from you your person both of you with a judgment next to it the character remains but the actual way how the knight of wands is temp uh, temporary i keep getting temporary i don't know what that really why they say it was temporary oh it was temporary so they're more let's see if it's going to be more of a structured permanency you're you're both getting wake woken up to you're too casual you're too you know to what you're spoke to your truth like for example i say on this channel all the time um your twin flame you're watching me your twin flame light worker star seed your truth is you are humanitarian you are what we are you'll see us on this community about you know um transmutation of natural energy helping people who suffer from sexual abuse abandonment issues neglect and all that kind of thing plus we volunteer i'm trying to get a shelter homeless shelter with mental health all that kind of thing that's your truth but you're too casual at it my version of casual is doing reiki acupuncture yoga meditation tower readings that's not really How's that helping anyone? If you're watching me and I say, book me for a tower reading, you've got mental health. What's that got to do with it? You're, you're struggling, homeless. What's that got to do with it? You suffered sexual abuse. You'd see what's tower readings got to do with it? The truth is you find out about mission. Mission is not just what you're saying. Now, with your person's side, it's the same. Why are you casual when your core being is this person? That's generally the twin flame. My readings are generally now lean towards explaining that most people don't know what the contract is it's waking them up to what the true true self is what the truth truth of the twin flame what what they really are here for and it's about getting balls and doing what we're doing what we're doing in mission even the fact that we're doing tower readings and explaining about mission and telling you what to do to get your person that is still putting us in our masculine because if we just do tower readings, oh, they're coming back around, they love you, namaste, and, and that, we'll get more likes, more subscribers, more views. But we have to go out there and say things that you don't necessarily want to hear, which people click on and click off, that keeps our views low. So we've got to have balls to do that and not see it as a, I see it as a um, as a fashion, as a joke, as casual, as the Knight of Wands, which other tarot readers say. Oh, well, you know, this is only entertainment only in the description box and all this kind of stupid nonsense when tarot is a story of your life. It's how to live on this planet, tarot, because tarot is connected with the Kabbalah, which is exactly the same thing. How you live off this planet is a philosophy of alchemical elements and your planet Earth, how to combine them to get your best experience on this planet. So this is about they're waking you up to the truth, not just, oh, I'm a twin flame. I've got a special connection with someone. And, you know, that's why we're, we're so cussed out by other tower readers who don't know what twin flames are. They all oh, twin flames think they're the special ones and the chosen ones and they think they're better than us, you know, because that's all we that's all what most twin flames do. 
I've got special connections, special and, and not. If we was up here doing what we do in mission, which you're welcome to join us, then we would have a far better name. And we would and we're here to help everyone, soulmates to everyone on this planet. I welcome a soulmate into the community if they chose. This is what this is. You're too casual. It's waking you up to your truth. The four of cups is you're dissatisfied. You're both dissatisfied with this casualness. Now you're dissatisfied with your life. Literally. You're sat there and you're like, shall I do this? Shall I do that? I've done Reiki. I've got some crystals around at home. You know, I've got salt lamp. What the fuck? Do you know what I mean? I, I, you know, I see tarot readers, sage in the table. Oh, yeah, sage is pretty good, but you got to remove negative within you. There's no point saging up the cards when your channel messages are from upstairs through you and you're filled with negative. No point saging the cards. This is about learning, knowledge, intellect with the Ace of Swords, truth. So the truth is you're both bored with your situations of life, but you're staying stuck in a rooted belief system of, I don't know what you're, you know, this is how, it's, I don't know. And I really don't know, because I'm like, I don't know why Twin Flames don't get into mission or, you know, it's even too late for me to realistically say to Twin Flames, look, you can do your own mission. Because from last beginning of this year, it was all about collaboration. Year before, I could have said, listen, you don't have to join us. You can just do your own, but make sure you're doing helping sexual abuse. Make sure you're doing voluntary work. You're not just chatting on YouTube. What actual work are you doing? Talking is not actually doing anything, but you can do that and create your channel. Now, it's like not even that. You, they need you to collaborate. That's the truth. This is waking you up to your what your happy happiness is. Now, most twin flames know their twin flame is their person. That's all you got to know. You don't need to like do anything else. So do the rest of your happiness. This, this is the trick of the twin flame journey, which most people don't seem to understand. You find someone and you're like, oh my gosh, what's this all about? I feel so connected, feel home. So you feel connected with the planets. And all this stuff, you research and you find someone up on YouTube talking about, you know, very rare, six to ten people of Twin Flames up on YouTube. So you understand what kind of connection you have. Not to copy them, to sit up on YouTube and say, hey, it's my person. I'm a Twin Flame. No. Just so you simply know, oh, shit, that's me. Yes, I had this whirlwind, funky connection when I met him or her. I felt like I'd known them for years. You know, I see one, one, two, 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 four, four, whatever. That's all that they're up there for. That's why there's not loads of twin flames up here. Then next is mission. You already met your person. You know they're your happiness. So the next thing is work out what your path. That's why it's called 1111. It's not called 111, is it? One, 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 one. What's that? You know, it's not 1111, is it? Why do they say 11? 11 you find your path then your person gets onto their path that's why it's like that because two's a path 11 11 is path right this will then create balance in your life because now like i said with a knight of wands that's casual so you're only like oh i'm only getting crumbs sophia well no wonder why because you're what you give out you've heard that saying is what you get back so you're only giving out what your truth is. You are a star seed, right? This is the sun, the planet, right? You are a seed from the stars, sun, right? Planets, right? So it's like, so you are supposed to follow your star seed humanitarian work to heal this planet, the sun, right? Without the sun, it's planet, the planet's fucked, right? It's dead, dead. So you're connected to the sun, to the planets, the stars that heal this planet. So you know, well, that's what I've got to do then. I've got to do something that's healing the planet. Not walking out in nature with Jesus sandals and touching the grass with my toes and pretending I'm getting downloads. Like, what the fuck's that doing? Nothing. Just like crystals, acupuncture, Reiki, meditation. Nothing. Nothing. 
That's why you're doing little. That's why you have someone who is a player, who is casual, who is temperate. What you give out, what you get back. That's, that's the balance of this life. The Seven of Swords is at the bottom of the deck. That just proves that you're lying to yourself. What you're doing is all right. You're kidding yourself, right? You might attract someone who's lying to you. And you're like, what the fuck? This guy, is, this girl's always lying all the time. I'm like, well, this planet's law, like attracts like. Oh, Sophia, I'm not lying to them. I don't lie, lie to no one. This planet is just lies, right? They can't pinpoint specifics. How many fucking humans are on planet Earth? So it's like, okay, right? This is how this planet works. It's easy, right? If you keep attracting someone who is lying to you and then you leave that person, you attract someone else who's lying to you, then there's something within you that you're lying, right? That's it. Not specifics, but it's kind of easy that way, right? If you keep going out there and you're sleeping with people, you'll keep going out there cheating. There's something to do with sexual abuse because that's that kind of trait of sexual abuse. That's what you need to work on. It's easy, the planet's law. They don't pinpoint specifics, but this is what it is. And what are you lying about? And I can guarantee it's to do with your truth of this, your happiness. Yes, we know you. what your happiness is, your twin flame. What else? Are we here on planet Earth just to have our partners? So you can't be like me. Have my twin flame. Have a community. Collaborate with brilliant people in the community. Now, boots on the ground trying to make a, a, a mental health shelter for homeless. You can't do that as well. Why? Me and you are both the same. What's the difference? That's what this is about. Your version of happiness. We're here to teach people, stop focusing on things, the physical body, for your happiness. Let's get some, um, what else they're going to say from upstairs. But getting into your masculine, what you're doing is pussy work. And I'll say that to any tarot reader who says that they are twin flame and tarot is their mission. Say that's pussy work. Stop lying to yourself. That's not what we're here for. And I don't associate myself with you in the slightest. And I can pretty much guarantee that that twin flame who says, I'm a twin flame and just doing tarot, I'm a twin flame, just doing Reiki, I'm a twin flame, just doing whatever's right. Acupuncture, selling crystals is not with their person. I can 100% I can stake my life on that. Let's get some advice from additional advice. Loads flipped over, but I can't take them all. Let's just sort them. Is that what the right way around? Jeez. Oh my gosh. I, I flipped it round. I'll have to do it at the end. Sun again. I told you this is about your happiness. Tower in your ass. Your foundation. And this is looking at your person to be physical foundation. This could be your body, your health. But I feel this is about how you feel about getting your person, the physical, because the tower is a physical, needs to crumble, right? Five of, cup, uh, five of pentacles. This was coming out kind of in the reverse to me. So this is about you're left out in the cold because you feel your person lied to you, cut you off or something like that, ghosted. And I'm making a program about that, right? If you're struggling with ghosting, you're struggling with your connection, book counselling with someone in the community. I'm making a programme about how to release your person, but be connected to them at the same time so you can get on with your life. Most people struggle like this reading. Third party situation here, three of cups, three of swords. And that's why you're like, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm this, casual. This is someone new. You're either new, I uh, don't care if you've been with your person 10 years, this is new to finding out what this connection is. And if you're not new, you're simply just watching me doing jack shit. Doing nothing about the connection. Just watching, watching, watching. Because this is someone who's definitely new. This is a new, like, I've just met my person, there's third party, there's heartbreak, there's not doing nothing. You know, I just want, I just want them on the physical 
And that's another reason why they don't come towards you, because you just want them on the physical way of life. The house, the car, the picket fence, right? And then they go just come towards you, they mirror that, right? Or I would just come to you and have physical sex with you then, right? When you're rising to all alchemical elements, then they, they rise. Oh, definitely someone who's new here. Look at you. Oh, I'm loving light, Sophia. I'm alien. But what, what's all these negative souls around you? Oh, I don't have negative. It's just my friend, my best friend who I've known from school. And my mum and dad love me. Friends and family are still influencing you. Stop looking for validation of love outside of you. You are enough. Third eye awareness. Third eye exercise. Twin flame program. I don't think I have a third eye exercise. I don't know why. Some of these I'm reading, I'm like, I don't know. I don't know why I've got some of these words on here. I must have been too busy with work. That's all I can think of. But anyway, a twin flame program here. And this is about, like I said, people, when I say negative people, they think of Freddy Krueger. You could sit in the living room, sit in the living room next to Tony Robbins. To me, Tony Robbins is negative. He sells millions of pounds of programs, damn well knowing that the million pounds of programs that people buy of his website and download, that no one does anything with it. That's a negative person. That is like, yeah, just buy the programs, right? Knowing it doesn't do anything, that's negative. Why doesn't he make programs to target more on a one-to-one -one like we do in Mission? Because you, they, he knows that people don't, they need more of a one-to-one. -one. That's why we offer counselling. So many people bought my programs when I was selling it. I had to say, I talk now more about counselling than the programme. There is not one person in four years, and I've had hundreds of people buy my programme, that's come to me and said, I've done it by myself by just listening to your programme. Because we're not programmed that way. My point is, I don't care who you perceive them to be. They're not thinking as the way as you're supposed to think as a light worker, as an alien being. So they're negative. And look, you here, but look how many's here. One, two, three, four. This is mum, dad, best friend, auntie Sarah, this one, that other friend, and this and that, right? All these entities override your one. Unless you're removing the not darkness, right? You see the darkness around your heart. You don't understand the twin flame contract, like I said. So let's close it out with what um, the laws of this planet. You cannot change from the frequency where you, it was created. You're created and programmed to watch television, darkness. Friends and family put you in the darkness, plugged into the matrix, darkness. And you think you're just going to wake up because you met your twin flame and all the darkness has just vanished. No. You cannot change that frequency from where it was created. Einstein, know your facts, right? So you have to come away from them. It's factual. You are the people you hang around with. And the people you hang around with probably don't have no idea about Twin Flame. They don't know what you're about. Oh, you, 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 you're with someone who's cheating on you. How dare they complain about someone who may, and there's a high possibility, may have suffered sexual abuse? How dare they scorn them? Would they, would they cuss out someone who, who was, had a face with autism? No, they wouldn't, would they? There's plenty of hidden disabilities and diseases and problems within people. You are here not to judge, and same with these friends and family around you. And the top thing that someone, because you've got cheating here, third party here, that has that is someone who suffered from sexual abuse. Promiscuous. This is someone who's new or someone who's not learning, right? Same old mistake. But it's judgment call to your truth. You are attracting your truth. You're casual. That's why you're attracting casual. Page of Wands up in here. Um... Uh, so a message, so this might be coming round again. It's up to you if you're going to keep lying to yourself or you're going to get help to move forward. I had to get help. This community got help. No one done it alone up in here. I feel this pull towards, huge pull towards you and it scares me. Twin flame, twin flame. Unhealthy attachments. What did I say? Who's them lot, right? 
unhealthy attachment. Same as your person, third party, right? I do see myself settling down with you, right? Probably want them to live with you. They do see that. I don't feel good enough for you, so I run. This is you working on yourself because you don't feel good enough to do. Well, you can't. It's an impossibility. You're listening to other twin flame tower readers to do this alone. Right? So you run from doing what you really are. So they reflect back to you. They run. This person's gone ghost, gone to the third party. And here's you, still tied to them. They're your happiness, but trying to walk away from it. You can't. You have to deal with things. Right? All right, I'm out. Speak to you later.